You know, back in the early 2000s, you couldn't throw a rock without hitting at least one person who would love to talk your ear off about Fox's procedural crime series Bones if given a chance. The series, which starred Emily Deschanel and David Boreanaz as Dr. Temperance Brennan and FBI agent Seely Booth respectively, was a massive success after a bit of a rocky start, yes. But naturally, it of course got a spin-off after its sixth season. I mean, come on, how could you not follow it up? The spin-off, titled The Finder, follows a man named Walter Sherman, a retired army major with extraordinary analytical skills that at times felt borderline supernatural, along with his crew of compatriots as they solved crimes and found missing objects and people. It was loosely tied to bones, with a few characters appearing here and there, but it largely tried to stand on its own. Unfortunately, The Finder had a hard time reaching fans of bones, and ended almost before it could take shape. The show was met with significant barriers from its inception. After originally being slated for Thursday night airings, the series was moved to Friday nights and aired out of order. The first season contained only 13 episodes, but enthusiasm was lacking and Fox decided not to renew it. Comparatively, Bones continued to have great success as it aired six more seasons before concluding in excellent fashion in 2017. A large part of its failing can probably be pinned on the show's tone. Bones was marketed and clearly designed to be a more realistic take on crime scene investigations, while The Finder utilized some fantastical elements that just felt awkward being connected to Bones, as the two shows didn't seem to be catering to a similar audience. 